Hey guys, it's me, Melissa, and welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to a Dollar Tree haul. I've not done one of these in a very long time. My mom's been kind of taking over on that side of the Dollar Tree thing and the daily deals. So I was like, you know what? I'm going to go stop there. It's been forever since I've gone to the Dollar Tree. And let me tell you, it's not as exciting as it used to be. I don't know, I feel like there used to be like all these new items. I stopped by the one by work, not the one by my house. And it's, I don't know, like, I did get some stuff, obviously, but it's, I don't know, it's the same as exciting as it used to be, where I was doing, like, a Dollar Tree haul once a month. Like, I'm not finding a lot of the stuff that my mom finds, like, all the fun things that she said that other people find. But, without further ado, let's get into what I bought yesterday. Now, we're going to be doing some, like, touching up of stuff, like, we were, we took... You know, if we don't put the other thing back, we still need to, like, touch up these holes over here. All this stuff. So, I bought... It's a three-pack. There were two different kinds. I bought this one. The other one was, like, bigger than this. And, like, that wasn't bigger. Maybe it was, like, that size and that size. But I bought the three-pack because I'm not sure what we're going to need. I mean, my dad said he buys these all the time. They seem fine. I mean, it's not like we're doing our full whole room or anything like that. We're just going to be doing touch-ups. Then, this, I thought was crazy. I just picked it up just because I thought it was crazy. Of, it's by eCircuit, a fake security camera. Fake security camera. I didn't know that was a thing. And you can put batteries in it and everything. And you can mount it somewhere. And I guess I'm not going to go get batteries for it, but all that will happen will, this will turn to red light. Just like that. And you just put it somewhere and let other people would think that they're being filmed. I guess you put outside your house? I don't know. It's light enough to where I feel like you could just use like a sticky thing and just stick it on there. Should I put batteries in it? I'll put batteries in it. Man, I was fresh out of fresh out of batteries to go take it out of something else. But I mean it doesn't stay on all the time. It just could be mine. Maybe the batteries are old. I don't think this does anything with it. Anyway, I'm not actually gonna use it for anything. I make sure I take these out. I just thought it was a funny thing. And for $1.25, I'll pick up a funny thing. Maybe I'll throw it in a junk drawer box for you guys. <laughs> um, let me put those over there so I don't lose them. Next thing I got. I don't know. I was wondering if I would make the cheap chick in this. It's like a board that hangs. This was like paper. I know it's going to be a DIY today. So I'm going to see if I can make the cheap chick. I tried to count out, but I wasn't exactly sure. So I'm going to see if I can make the cheap chick. And then I was like, maybe I can hang them up while I do the whatnots or whatever. So let me see if I can do that and I'll be right back. I did it. They move around a little bit easily because they are just paper. I don't know, should I just like hang it up here for now? Is that like... <laughs> I mean, I might. I might just put it up there for now as my one little decor. We want to do so many things. I mean, I know we're not going to live here much longer, but hopefully at some point we're going to get these shelves up. Maybe I'll put this in the middle of the shelves. Or on the shelf, kind of leaned over. The shelves are down here. I finally made it to that point. They were upstairs. Now they're downstairs. Step one. <laughs> step one's completed. How long step two will take? I don't know. Polo's right here, too. I wonder if I can snag him. I got him. He's not downstairs that much during the day. When Rob comes home, he's all about it. I think it's only like noon or one right now, but he's coming downstairs just to get a little... I don't know what he's doing. Let's say hi to everybody. Say hi. Look at all the spots on his belly. We love his belly. He doesn't always love when we touch his belly, but he loves it. I love it. We definitely, now he is definitely a, a huge part of the family. Like, he is totally a part of the family. I don't know how long he's going to stay here like this, <laughs> but yes, you're a part of the family. Yeah. Yeah, you are. Yeah, you are. You want to go? Why don't you go this way? I'll put you on the floor. There you go. There you go. It's been a long time you guys have seen Polo in a, in a video. So there you go. Next thing I picked up was this. I can't remember how much we paid for one in at Walmart. But Rob said it's always good to have shelf-stable milk in the house. And then we actually used it. Because Rob drinks milk a lot. But he's like, you never know when you're going to have a recipe or some sort of like hamburger helper or something that needs milk. And you don't have any. Um, that this is a good thing to have. So I picked up one of these. They had whole milk. 1%, 2%, I think fat-free. Rob's a whole milk guy, so I got the whole milk. Then I also picked up food-wise two of these Spanish rices. 
I, even though I feel like I'm not eating as healthy anymore, but it's like, I am so busy that like the easiest things, the better, really? Like, so this right here, squish it up, boom, microwave. This would be like two meals. I got, I kept saying to myself, like, I have chicken in there, so all I need to do is, like, cook the chicken, and then I got the rice, and then, boom, it's easy. So I got that, and I also picked up these for me and Rob. This is, like, the knockoff or the generic of the fudge stripes. So I got those. I kind of want to eat one. Just one. They look pretty much like them. They smell pretty much like them. They taste pretty much like them. Delicious. <laughs> Alright, that was bag number one. Here is bag number two. So I picked up one, two, should be three of them. Three. So I picked up three of these tags. Each one has 60 in it. And I'm hoping I could facilitate these during my whatnot. So some of the, like some of the stuff, I have those tags that I'm, to tape on things but it would be easier if I had some things where I could just tie them on and then still reuse them and then put like number them one through whatever maybe just like number two of them in case I lose one I can have this one to what are you doing over there <laughs> living his best life um like to when I mess up a number or I break a string I'll have extra backup one so I got that for that then I don't know I thought it was a good deal two pairs of like brand known <laughs> um socks for a dollar and my mom got the what did she get like marvel ones or something but yeah so a two pack of these for a dollar 25 i thought that was a good deal i got the doritos and i got the crush even though i don't really drink either one of these i didn't want to get a lot they had other ones that had white a white sock with it and a white sock just don't don't last well with me then they had this la colors bubble tea and it's supposed to be strawberry matcha. I do love a strawberry. And I do love a lip gloss. Let's see. I'm getting strawberry. It's raining. It's kind of strawberry, but not like hardcore strawberry. But it needs a lip gloss. And then I picked up two, I don't know, I figured these Disney Dorables. I got two of them. I figure I open them, I get the surprise, and then I give them to the neighbor girl. We get the mystery, and then I got them out of, there was three different things with them in it. So I got one out of each, hoping they'll be different, but you never know. I can't remember the other ones I've gotten. So let's see in this mystery what we got. Today we have, Aurora. So we got Aurora. I never saw that one. <laughs> I haven't seen many of these. Many of these new Disney characters, I just don't know. Do we got another Aurora? Or we got something else? It feels like something else. I probably should have saved that piece of paper. I don't know who you are either. Jesse. Is that Toy Story, Jesse? I think I watched the first two Toy Stories. How many are there now? Like 19? My cousin loves them. Now for the final bag number three. I don't know. My dad, when he said about this stuff, I put it in the downstairs toilet. I mean, it only stays blue for like a day or two. But if it's really going to sit there and clean better than like throughout, I'll just start putting them in all the toilets in the back. Like maybe like this much of it every couple weeks or every week or so. I don't know. So I got that. And then we were getting low on hand dish soap so i picked up this palm olive and it is the apple pear scent i wanted the grapefruit but because i'm cheap the grapefruit one was only this big so i got the apple pear it's not bad it's not like the smell really stays on your on your dishes but it's, it's a nice crisp scent i smell more out like apple i think than i do pear and then the final thing i got was this which i thought was a good deal i could be wrong let me know if this stuff is crap or not but you get two pods inside of it so you get one Thing and you get two so it's like literally getting 
two bottles. So supposedly, oh, and I like it's not um the tablets. I feel the tablets, they can be a pain in the butt. Um, getting them to dissolve, sometimes it takes forever for them to dissolve. Is this going to be hard? Is it? Yep. <laughs> I've got a decent amount on my leg. Not a whole amount, but a little bit. <laughs> and then just for purposes of the video, put this in a bag. And I don't love that. I bought a bottle of water. I bought some bottles of water just to have stuff out to get up. This will be very healthy. Spill the water on me. Oh my god, how much is gonna take? I think I brought two. I like the smell of it. I don't think I have any specifically like bathroom cleaner. And we'll stop about there. Yeah, I don't think I have any like I have all purpose cleaner, but I don't think I have any special like bathroom cleaner. I'm just slacking on my bathroom cleaning in general so I'm gonna bring this upstairs along with the refill and see if I can get my bathroom clean on so yeah smell nice so here we go a little green bathroom cleaner now I figured this was gonna be a super long video like I said I wasn't super duper having fun like I went I went around I found some things that made me smile but otherwise it wasn't as like a normal trip used to be say a year ago when it was still a dollar <laughs> um, I also the store that was across the street from my work didn't have any of the over dollar items except for in the freezer department. They had three dollars and five dollars, I believe. Three, four, and five dollars there. But otherwise, everywhere else, everything still was a dollar twenty-five. I heard some people say that it's going up again. Are they going to get a whole bunch of new stuff? Is it going to make you excited to go in there again? Because it's all the same stuff, and they go up to. They said they're going to have things as high as like seven dollars or something like that. Are they going to be high quality? What's it going to be like? I don't know. You don't know. I guess we'll figure it out. So, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If you have any comments or questions, please put them down below. If you hadn't yet subscribed. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you have an amazing day. I'll see you soon. Bye!